I'm Aran Chen of ODA. I'd like to share a new concept for the Flower District in New York. This case study demonstrates how we can expand the public realm, embrace density, and ultimately improve the life in our neighborhoods. While cities are expanding all over the world and super tall structures dominate our skyline, there's an increasing importance to reactivate our urban core and improving life at the street level. We looked at the historical Flower District located in the crossroad of iconic city landmarks and public parks in the heart of Manhattan, where community and commerce once flourished. This neighborhood, once filled with hundreds of flowers vendors, have been struggling for the past few decades. As traffic and cars have come to overpower pedestrians, it has become very hard to maintain a sustainable social and economic urban fabric. While typical streets are not enough to sustain a new density, existing city blocks have hidden courtyards that are privately owned and are underutilized. We propose a new city regulation that will encourage developers to bestow interior courtyards and create new connections to the street in exchange for an increase of floor area and height. As a result, the privately owned area will open up to the public. Now imagine a typical block where over time, these spaces are being created and passageways are connecting them to the street. The ground floor surrounding these newly formed courtyards can now be meticulously programmed, replacing urban decay with markets, small businesses, coffee shops, diversified housing, hospitality, urban farming, and public art, and will expand the public realm to create a true cultural experience. environmental, social, and economical sustainability will take root over time and expand in the Flower District and beyond. We look forward to a New York that is more inviting to explore with green nooks of secret experiences that expands the imagination and show the power of reinvention.